New up packing the ass, guess what? He'll still be a laugh right now if you niggas ain't passing. Give my shorty statements and guns, I tell him slap for nothing. Everybody with this gang gang shit, so. What is up, gang? I am back to the back to the back. But this is not a regular hair video, y'all. I decided to switch it up. But first, I did want to show you this new plucking method, y'all. I've never shown you guys how to pluck a wig on YouTube. It's crazy. So I decided with Ali Eunice's hair, this lovely long blonde hair, I will get all into it because I'm actually going to be talking in this video. It's not all the voiceover. But y'all, basically, I wanted to show y'all how to pluck a wig because I realized I've never done that. So I'm taking some really sharp tweezers. These tweezers make it very easy for you to grip the hair and pull it from the root so that you don't actually leave hair in the root. Because the whole purpose of plucking is taking the hair from the root to actually remove the knot and the hair as well. So what I'm doing right now is I'm just breaking up the hairline. I like to go where the hairline starts and just pull back on some parts to make a separation between each strand so that it looks more natural. It's very important to do this so your waist can look as natural as possible and it's also very important to pluck behind the hairline. A lot of the thickness of wigs actually comes behind the hairline and when you pluck just straight on the front of the hairline you're actually just going to be moving the hairline back. So make sure to pluck behind the hairline to achieve that really natural looking wig. I'm just gonna go ahead and pluck the front of the hairline and do this all around the hair y'all this is just ensuring that your wig is going to look flawless not a knot in sight and that's on period back 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 baldiana baldiana y'all anyways um as y'all see that little mini plucking tutorial or whatever but today I decided to actually not um, do a voiceover because I know my, my hair videos get a little bit repetitive or whatever. So I definitely wanted to just sit down and talk to y'all about this hair and show y'all how to install it like face to face girl. We need to do it. This hair is from Ali Unis Hair. I've paired with them before and girl, their hair is bomb. Oh, they're just really nice. Their customer service is great. So yeah. Anyways, this is a 24 inch um, long 613 hair. I'm not going to tone it because y'all I change my wigs every single day. I don't have time to tone this hair but you definitely should tone this hair to cancel out some of the yellow but i mean it's still really cute and i'm gonna curl this hair so it looks even better i haven't curled a blonde wig ever so i'm excited to see how this is gonna turn out with some body waves but it's very silky long smooth and soft and one thing about this hair is that the knots are completely invisible as you can see there's no like black little dots all over it's completely white so i'm gonna talk about my bald cap method i know some people get a little confused as to i really look a mess right now but excuse that i know some people get confused as to why i don't spray the bald cap um when you do wigs every single day when you change your wigs every single day you're gonna realize that baby girl your edges are gonna feel that feel that got to be spray or feel whatever spray you use on here your edges are really going to start thinning out like mine did i found this method where you actually glue it to your skin and not to the actual not to your edges you know what i'm saying so when you glue it to your skin you're not getting any glue or any spray on your edges which keeps your edges protected you see how right here all my edges are nice and out and just cooling right here is my skin so if i put the bold hold glue on my skin my edges will be protected i know a lot of people are like girl you don't know how to do wigs what are you like come on baby i'm the wig queen let's be honest so that's why i do that and by just gluing this part down it's protecting these edges right here so yeah i'm just gonna glue this down on both sides and, and then glue right here so that this ball cap can be secure and then we can go ahead and put the wig on after we apply one layer of my bold hold So now I'm going to glue this part down. But back to Eunice Hair. Um, Eunice Hair is an online hair company, as y'all know. They're actually on AliExpress. The one thing I really love about them is their lace. Their lace is really bomb. I'm actually going to make um, like my top five favorite brands of wigs ever. And Ali Eunice is definitely in there because not only is like their lace is amazing, but the quality of the hair there's a lot of things you can look for in wigs and when you're like me and i've seen hundreds of wigs 
you know what to look for and Ali Unis definitely is in my top brands ever. So look out for that video of my favorite hair brands just so y'all can get some insight on um, what brands can really finesse y'all. And that's on period. <laughs> so now I'm gonna apply my one layer of my bold hold. You can apply up to five if you want to, if you want your wig to last like a couple weeks. Girl, I would be having my hair be ripping out if I try to put five layers on because I be taking my wigs off every day. I also, see how I draw my glue in a pattern? Like this is how I cut my lace, like zigzag like that. Definitely take your time, you know, figure out a pattern for your hair. I always like the um, little widow's peak in the front. I think it makes lace, I think it makes lace fronts look like 10 times better. My girl, Eunice, really did it to me. I'm actually going to post a picture in this hair. I haven't taken it yet, but I'm going to be taking pictures after this. So, y'all should definitely follow my Instagram. So, y'all can see the bomb pictures I'm about to take. Because I'm really excited to see how this hair is going to look as a body wave. I either had, like, a blonde bob or I had long blonde straight. I've never had a body wave. So, girl, we about to see how cute I get. <laughs> period so you know when your glue is dry because like it's clear here we go this is my 24 inch 613 613 is the color of the hair some of y'all was like what is 613 613 is the color of the hair 24 is the inches 24 inches and this is a this has got to be a 13 by 6 so 13 inches across six back it actually might be a 6 13 by 4 no this is definitely a 13 by 4 four inches back 13 across it still gives you a lot of part in space if you wanted to do a side part if you wanted to do even you could really do a half up half down with this most wigs come with like this little flap of lace right here so i'm just gonna cut that off my head is pretty small so i just take these and bring them into the closest one right here as much as my head may look big like my head's actually small see now it's moved in closer so it's gonna actually fit my head i love me with blonde hair i don't care so then we gotta just adjust this. Like, trust the process. Honestly, with wigs, you really just gotta trust the process. Cause like, you won't be looking crazy right now. Like, girl, I look crazy right now. But, promise you by the end, I'm gonna be looking real cute. So I like to do middle parts because it frames my face the best, I feel like. So let me just make sure. This is not even in the middle, y'all. Oof. Okay, that's the middle. I just go like this right here just to move the lace. Oops. Move the lace into the glue before you blow dry it. This is just going to make sure, like, this thing is clinging on for dear life, girl. Nobody's snatching your wig off. Like, we don't got time for the blue face drum. That girl really snatched her wig off. So, we got to make sure we don't get our wig snatched. Let go. <laughs> You don't need to blow dry it for a long time just till it's like see i'm pulling she not moving that's a good sign let's pin her up let's get it time to cut the lace i need to bring this mirror close. i do not be messing up my lace i need to make sure that i'm cutting it good just pay attention okay pay attention because i can't be talking while i'm cutting the lace Yes, you niece, come through, babies. I love y'all. You know what? When y'all watching this, just know that I love your brand. And you all got me looking like a Barbiana. Like, let's keep moving on. Okay, so we're taking my trusty hot comb. You know what I'm saying? She even warmed up. Okay, so we're gonna take my hot comb. And this literally, like, this is what makes your wig look like bomb. I'm telling you, it's the easiest thing ever. Hot combs are mad cheap. That's how you get that slick look, girl. Not from no nothing else. Literally a hot comb is what does that. Pressing that here. Damn. I wish I could have toned this like a icy blonde. Like that would have been so tough. But like I really don't have the time. I wish I could have. But I do want to bump this up more. Like give it more of a. Like that. You know what I'm saying? So I'm kind of just going to run through it like that. Because when I do a body wave like I want it to be really voluminous so if i have it like that it's really gonna add to it a boom just cut the edges like you want to cut them short though because you don't want no long edges 
That ain't it. That ain't never been it. Add some mousse on that thing. Blonde edges be so cute because, like, they're so subtle. Like, you can't even really see them, but it's like, they're there and they're laid. Just the little edges, you know what I'm saying? It just adds a little bit of something. Okay, y'all, we're coming into form a little bit. This is how long the hair is. It goes almost to my waist. Let's curl this hair. Ah, girl, I did it, I did it, I did it. We back to the back to the back. Hair curl, then it comb it out. Wide suit comb. Get them curls nice and bouncy. But we're almost done. I just want to go ahead and take this off. See, that's laid. Ooh. Got an indent on my head and junk. Oh, I look cute. Oh my god, I look so cute. Okay, yes. So here is this hair by Ali Louise. But I absolutely love this hair, y'all. It's so silky, so smooth. It curls really well. And yeah, I think the colors honestly bomb even when it's not tinted. Like, this is still so cute. So thank you, Ali Louise, for the wig. It looks so bomb, as y'all see. I love y'all so much. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for watching this video if you made it to the end. I absolutely love so y'all i will see y'all next video don't forget to like comment subscribe and share check out ellie uni's hair if you want to get some bomb hair like this you know what i'm saying silky smooth oh i look like a million dollars okay y'all bye love you